Hello guys, I've been working on the last of uh, my six old PCs that I'm uh, repairing and I saw a problem with this hard drive. It was uh, not turning on or turning off by itself randomly. First I thought uh, there might be a problem with the cables. As I moved the cables sometimes it would start up again but now it refuses to start up and I took it out and upon closer inspection as you can see all of these are corroded so hopefully uh, <laughs> this is not dead completely and uh, I can uh, undo all the screws and clean the board on the other side what I'm thinking that maybe there is some corrosion here so the platters are not uh, spinning hopefully it might be completely dead because of the corrosion who knows but let uh, but let's uh, take this out first as i suspected there is some corrosion there on some contacts and also here Hopefully you can actually see that and random uh, bits of uh, corrosion powder, I don't know how to call it, oxide it's actually uh, on the board. So this is pretty weird, I don't know what kind of environment this hard drive saw it's in its lifetime but I've never seen this thing. So I'm going to clean it with uh, a brush and alcohol and uh, let it dry up and then try to pour it on because mm, I can't really do anything else. Of course, check, make sure all the solder joints uh, from these plugs here are okay, but I think they will be okay. Who knows? So probably when I was moving actually uh, the cables here, I was actually moving the whole board just a little bit enough to make contact for a moment. That's pretty weird. Cleaned it up. So let's give it a test. And nothing. Oh well, it might be dead. Opened this thing up again cleaned uh, these pads even better this time and I took a really really good look maybe you can see there corrosion between the uh, legs of the chip I don't know if you can see there but there also is some corrosion so where there are uh, chips <laughs> you can find corrosion between their uh, little legs so yeah, I'm going to use this to try and remove that corrosion between them and then give this a good uh, clean again with contact cleaner this time. But yeah, this might be truly dead. This thing is as clean as it will ever get. But uh, if it's already dead from a short circuit when it was corroded, then this will not uh, help at all. But, let's give it a test and see what happens. Okay, it's dead as a dodo. <sighs> Doesn't do absolutely anything. Tried uh, with another PSU, tried another hard drive in this computer just to make sure everything is working. This is dead. I also tried to remove the diodes from 5 and 12, uh, 12 volts uh, sometimes uh, from an electrical shock they can get uh, damaged and basically they protect everything uh, after them and if that's uh, what happened if you remove them uh, it will work until the next next shock when it will kill it because there is no other protection but uh, it, it didn't help so clearly uh, the corrosion got to this board Maybe there is just a tiny point when 
where something is not making contact or it actually shorted uh, one of these uh, chips probably this one this is the motor controller and uh, yeah that's enough to to kill the hard drive luckily i don't have any important data onto this thing so yeah it doesn't really matter to me but it's kind of annoying if i would have sold the corrosion i would have cleaned it before uh, it uh, died so from now on I, I know to check for corrosion on hard drives really weird but it seems it can happen so yeah thanks for watching like comment subscribe and see you in the next one bye